Hello everybody, Ragtag Sagvi here. Welcome to the next episode. In the last episode, uh, we explored around the monastery. Hey, he had a lot of meals and did some fishing, and now? Oh, for this week we're going to be forced into a battle. Auxiliary battles are now available. How often you can battle is limited by your activity points indicated at the top of the screen. On normal difficulty, some auxiliary battles will not cost any uh, activity points. If you end the battle while playing online, you may see spirits of those who perish on, on other players' battlefields. They are more likely to appear in places where death is frequent. Spirits that appear in this shade indicate the area where enemy units and it's have fallen. You can click items where they are dropped by the vanished. Spirits that appear in this shade indicate the area where allied units were lost. This, they can impact blessings such as experience or restore equipment durability. So because this is our first time in auxiliary battles, it will force us to do this battle. Uh, any other time we do auxiliary battles, because we're playing on lower difficulties, we will get uh, auxiliary battles that don't cost any points, which is great for grinding. Which is where our, is why I'm going to be releasing this every weekend, so that way I can take the time to grind on those maps. But anyway, let's do a practice battle. A practice battle with the Knights of Saros, set up to simulate real battlefield conditions. I love the pilot down there. It looks like he's sliding, so he looks like he's doing the moonwalk. In battle, it's necessary to deploy battalions so that students can experience taking command. I doubt I need to say this to a mercenary like you. But if you have any questions about how to use your soldiers, please don't hesitate to ask. After you hire a battalion, you'll need to decide who will lead them. Battalions can contain soldiers like mages and monks who don't fight with weapons. Be sure to think carefully about who would benefit most from the support of battalion soldiers and their specific skills. Use the inventory menu to assign battalions to your units, gathering the battery. Let them increase stats like attack or hit rate. These stats will grow further as the battalion gains experience and fights alongside you. When you deploy a battalion, you can utilize its special gambit in battle. If a gambit is successful, your enemy will be severely shaken. You, units hit by gambits will be rattled. Rattled units cannot move. Use gambits or or benefit from battalions and suffer and suffer a 10% penalty to all stats. Joining forces with a nearby ally is a surefire way to enhance your effectiveness. When a gambit is used on an enemy with an attack range of one or more of your other units, it will become a gambit boost. The might item hit rate of the gambit will increase based on the number of units participating in A and their support levels. So this is everybody that's going to be taking part. So let me check my abyss care. So who do you have supports with? Nobody in... Okay. You only have supports with me. You have supports with nobody in my house. You have supports with Ferdinand and Adel. And Lineheart. you be there you can take constants and I'll hang on to Barris because apparently he cannot have supports with anybody he and uh, Black Eagle so inventories let's equip our battalions so I'll, I automatically get Gerald's mercenaries I'll probably equip everybody with battalions off screens when needed.
uh, especially as they level up their 40s, that way they can use more and more uh, different types of battalions. Okay. Be with that. Let's equip you with that. Yuri. And Petra. Yeah, I think I might just edit their battalions off screen when possible. But we'll go with this for the time being. Route the enemy. Stay focused. Well done. Let's deploy the shield. I will get the victory. Sure thing. That's my cue. Put me in there. Got some training gauntlets. I'm Ferdinand von Eyer. Need some experience. Greatness awaits me. Oh no. Eh. Battle. <laughs> eh. Battle. I will prevail. You hide in the trees. So let's watch what the enemy up to, gets up to you. Not not bad at Edo Guard. The good thing is that in this game, even when they're attacked, they do gain experience, uh, gain support points. Which is something I think Engage took away. Because I think they only gain the support points if they are the attackers and not defending. At least that's what it feels like in Engage. Let's hit you with a spell. Nice. Let's ax you. You've grown to level three, Caspar. Ooh, that's a good level up. Have you attack from the trees? 
Flame Spirit, protect me. It'll go into the attack. You're weak. Oh, I forgot something to show about the I'm Ashen Wolves characters. Can I? Nope, that's not the right buttons. There we go. There's menu. Uh, can I see it for the? Nope, that allows. I'm gonna have to remember to do this. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do it like, uh, and then uh, when we leave this battle, because I forgot to show off some things about the Ashen Wolves. Can attack. Oh, she can attack with thunder. I like she's an attack rage, and I forgot she already knows thunder. Bernetta, shoot her with a shoot him with your belt. Can I go now? What did I expect? <laughs> You can wait there. Move there. Come on, Fernand. Good, you take him out, but he's really hurt. They really hate Ferdinand. And I wouldn't be surprised if the other guy there decides to go and attack. Yep. So shameful. How could I fall like this? This is going to hurt, okay? Ooh, a crit! I won't go down so easily. Yeah, that was sweet. Whenever you see them, their face appear on the screen like that, and you hear them say a uh, special battle quote, that's whenever they get a crit, and it does. Oh, I'm trying to remember. Does crits do twice or three times the times the damage? It or if you get a crit, uh, it's almost guaranteed to kill somebody or severely weaken them to the point where you can finish them off. Just do be warned: the enemy can crit you, and when they do, it is not a fun time. Here, hit him a spell. We're here and swing your sword, Yuri. <laughs> Who is next? Let's start moving forward. Wow, they all hate Edelgard. Jesus. Whoops. Really? Is it really going to be raining outside? I hope the rain doesn't get too loud to the point where it can be picked up on the mic. That's not gonna be fun for commentating. Way to go. <laughs> right. Ooh, Petra's gonna get a double attack. And a crit! Is 
disappointing, but I will not misplace my heart. It'll hit level four. That won't do it all. Ooh, that was a poor level up. Right, let's bring Hubert and Casper into the battle. Please heal Edelgard. Well go take out that soldier. One more success. Here you go into the attack. Fast enough to do double. Let's have you attack from behind. Give you a sapping. Good, you're down. Each now I have Edelgard left to attack. Let's try it on. Let's try Gambit. Let's show these off. Good, and I, that's what I thought. It affects the guy behind him. Hubert, go in for the attack. I'm shocked you made it easy. Caspar, you come here. Heal up Casper so you gain a bit of experience, Slinehart. Ooh, that will finish him off. Go here and grab this. So we get, ooh, an Iron Lance. That's not a bad drop. And let's finish it off. Should I have held back? Such power dwells within. So both Violet and Bull is leveled up. Blood and sweat was worth it. Impressive. Let's just send it to the convoy. We can sell that later on. on the MVP. Oh, I can... I can do another practice battle? I would have automatically kicked me out. I didn't think I would do another practice. 
All right, let's do another practice battle. My, thank you so the voter only did, did the one practice battle, and then you automatically move on to the rest of the week. I am grateful. All right, I'll do an extra battle on this, and then I'll probably end the episode and then cut to... And then probably start the next episode of what happens after you do the uh, next practice battle. Uh, do, 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 do. The annoying thing about this, I always have to reset these. All right, so let's do it again. Put me in there. Grab ourselves a training axe. The noble standard. Oh no. I will prevail. All right, Edelgar, you can go into the woods. Let's activate our Sofa Shield. As you wish. That's my cue. I will get the victory. Can you go up there? Sure thing. You, you can go here. That's the skill of a noble, so it gets skill. plus five HP. Quick studies. Okay, nobody hit each other that time. Let's uh, shoot you. Have you shoot this guy? <laughs> Unleash the thunder. All roses have thorns. Not quite what I was after. Master of skill. I've really made this my own. And we grabbed her a training sword. Yes, let's attack you with some magic. Hardly worth my time. Any experience is worth having. Now, Fernand, stab him with a spear. Yeah. Actually, let's have you attack Lionheart. Victory.
Petra, move in for the attack. Disappointing, but I will not misplace my heart. Fatal Guard, swing that axe. What is the enemy going to do? Of course, Ferdinand is becoming the punching bag. Uh, I can't wait when he when I start class changing him and he actually gets really good. Flame spirit protect me. Nice going, Yuri. Alright, she's not in range to attack anybody. Not worth the risk. Have everybody start cutting their way for the woods. Go and attack. I will remove you. Ooh, and critical hit. Witness Bridget Pride. But I will not misplace my heart. You're in good form. Let's have you attack a Natsuratu. Can't get ahead of myself. If only my research had such results. Crack. Go here so that way on a target. Wait, can you heal Yuri? Oh yes you can, I forgot you have healed the stage. It's over yet. I'll never be satisfied. Oh, he's dead. I love that crit, that crit, cr cr uh, that crit quote from Byleth. Let the lessons begin. <laughs> Casper, let's go and swing your axe. to swing your axe. You, I think you'll do more damage than your gambit. Time to set my aims even higher. Hit him with some dark magic. You worked hard for nothing. Bernie, shoot him with your bow. Oh, I get it now. 
And we'll have Yuri run up and attack with his sword. <laughs> Who's next? Heal up Bernadetta. So you can get some experience. Let's have you go deep and attack this guy. Down you go. That is that. I'm not setting a very good example. Uh, that was a poor level up. Let's give you a sapping. Winning's always nice. And let's put you there, Edelgard, so it lures that guy out. Don't waste my time. <laughs> and he's dead. Failure is not an option. It's a long road yet. Gambits. You can't do it. Face for helping. Bernie, how about you get the killing blow? And Edogar was the MVP of this one. Alright, so I think I'll end the episode here. In the next episode, I'll see you after the after this practice battle, where we will continue the story. If you enjoyed this episode, do you like the videos? It helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below on your thoughts of this episode. And share the video so more people can discover my content and help the channel grow. And I'll see you all next time. Later.